Well, smack my ass and shave my balls. It's the best damn podcast from Chippewa Falls. Dan's in there just. <laughs> 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 Good morning, all you hick guys and gals. Welcome to Tales from the Hicks, and who have we got with us today? Hey, I'm Jason. And the I'm destroyer. Ooh, the, <laughs> destroyer. <laughs> the Destroyer. The Destroyer. BDC seems, in the house. It seems like there's some information you're not sharing. My name is Nate. Oh, we'll, we'll get this it out. Don't worry. Okay. I'll, I'll share all the information with you. Share away. Well, no, yeah. My oh, turn. Okay. What, is, what your, is your turn? I can't wait. No, what's the temperature? I've been scared all night. <laughs> he told me yesterday he was going to destroy me today, so Whoa. I'm a little nervous. Hopefully that's off the air. Huh. <laughs> uh 55 55 and there's an eight mphs out there it sounded blowier are than you that. sure eight what is did it? you just say eight did you just say it sounded blowier than that <laughs> yeah, jason always says it's blowy out oh. so i figured yeah. it sounded blowier sure. than sure blowier it's it blowier. seems like it's way more windier than that i don't i had eight the mm-hmm. uh the app mm-hmm. i use said eight huh and but that's from the nws uh, yep. National yep. Weather Service. Yep. I w- I'm assuming you know that. The Weather Channel <laughs> app. <laughs> it's TWC. That's where I get all my information. Oh. My phone says the wind is from the west northwest at 17 miles an hour. Yeah. yeah. Maybe yours said 18. Holy Jim. fuck, it is 18. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I was yeah. going to say, dude, it's way more windier than 18. Yeah, look at that. It says right there 18 huh. from oh. the northwest. MPH is. Is that your own handwriting? Yeah. 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 He texted yeah. to himself. Minutes ago. Yeah. <laughs> 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 All right. Good job. Uh, hey, yeah, don't, no. hey don't, don't worry about it. You're not going to get fired Oops. because they do it every day on the we'll weather. We'll send so you the way of our fucking other tech yeah. guy, too. Wow. You're fine. Go. <laughs> I don't know what you guys heard, he but it's, it's 55 and it's 18 MPH. Is that there. That sounds so way good. much better. Yeah. Take two. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Feels like huh. 44. Ooh, does it? Mm-hmm. So for those of you listening that take our weather seriously, oh, just don't. Maybe don't. Don't, don't, don't rely on us too much. Yeah. Especially well, given it's about a week late. I was going to say. I mean, like, I think what you what should go ahead and bank fuck? on it. You think so? Yeah. yeah. Well, a week from now it might be. Just Maybe. just because you're going to listen to this on the 12th when it's going to be 80. Yeah. You know, don't don't worry about that. Maybe the 13th. Yeah. Fuck. You'll have to start projecting it. That's what they do. No, I won't. You will. You're the weatherman. Yeah. That's, no, I'm saying I'll have to project it for the following, you oh, know, following eight week. days from yeah. now. Mm. Yeah. Be better than now. Sure. Yeah. So we can clue them in to let them know that just, um, so now we record on a, say we record on a Sunday, it airs the following Monday, like the like eight, eight days, days later. later. So, mm. yeah. That would explain sometimes why we're a little off on, like, we can talk now. The Vikings There's just won. There's a lot more reasons. Oh, does that make that them explain five? five and I was just going to say that myself. That yeah. they're five and all? We're off all the time. Yeah. I yeah. think he's. I think he heard me, five and all. Yeah. Blah, 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 so blah. So who did blah. they lose to them this year? Um, well, including preseason, that would be no one. Oh, that's where the zero comes. That's okay, where the I zero get, is. Yeah, yeah, I get yeah. it. Which coincides yeah. with these two iq <laughs> burn i gotta try to get some shots in Ooh. before i get destroyed and i'm completely i just done. i feel so bad about myself i can hardly stand it oh you do yeah it's oh just terrible no, I, I i would like to say though it was kind of nice when we were watching the game just a few minutes ago all yeah. four of us were all cheering for the vikings it this is true kinda, it was nice it was yep. hmm. i was that, not i don't recall that at all it was this nice uh, cohesive group same Darnold is the quarterback right now of the Vikings. Mm-hmm. I don't recall that at all. Oh, okay. I'll have to go back and play. Them. Yeah. I'll see if I can find some more before footage. Yeah. Mm. There's cameras are always watching. They're I was always, never cheering. Oh. Yeah. Mm. They're like Jesus and Santa Claus, always mm, watching. Yeah, zero fucks are given. Oh. oh. Mm. But yeah. Maybe I mean, that's what the zero stands for. <laughs> that could have been. Well, yeah. We got to get them in when we can. Right. We, we know history. It seems that. By the end of the season, there's not much to give you guys shit about. 
No. But until then, yeah, enjoy it while you sit can. Sit the fuck in the back of the bus. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's a new leader. <laughs> Kings of the North. Well, I guess he told you. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. Well, I'll be quiet now. Okay. Well, while he's quieting up, Chad, yeah. why don't you tell us what you've been up to this last week? Uh, went fishing. I heard you went fishing yesterday. I heard that. For like an hour. You were it was done. like an hour and 30 minutes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Where'd you go? Uh, Little Lake Wasoga. Uh, just did some trolling. That was it. No casting or none How'd of you that. Do? Uh, terrible. Oh. That's but why it was, you're only out there for an hour and change? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and I had a lot of little odds and ends that I wanted to do yesterday anyway, but the opportunity presented itself, and I was like, yeah, I'll go fishing. So we went. I only planned on fishing <clears throat> until 10 regardless. Um, but, yeah, no, it was cut shorter than expected, and hmm. I was fine with it. I got to say, you had me on Agile all day yesterday. Really? Yeah. Why? Well, you send me a message at 10 o'clock in the morning saying, well, what are you doing today? Oh, I yeah. respond back saying, not much, just going to the marching thing later, and yeah, then nothing. nothing the rest of the time. Well, it's because you were busy. Not until later. Well, that was when, okay, well. <laughs> I'm going to do that every once in a while from now on. Just, yeah? Just message <laughs> Nate and be like, hey, what do you got going on today? <laughs> Yeah. I did nothing. Well, it's because he responded that he was busy for the time that I was thinking I didn't of want to doing do something. I just, yeah. I just wanted to know what Well, I wasn't going to, after he told me that, I was like, well, in case it sounds fun. Never yeah. mind then. He's busy. So I just sure. let it go and I went on about my day. So what you should have done was, Nate, what are you doing around 4 35 o'clock? Well, it was 2 30, I was thinking. So, and well, I knew, been, yeah, now we're, where we were going. Oh. No. So, where, what were we, now you, can you let me know <laughs> what we were going to do? What no. did I mean? Fucker. Yeah, so. You're supposed to be telling us about what you did this week. Yeah. Well, well so I you didn't just do it. <laughs> oh, well, fuck you then. I couldn't go, so he ended up yeah. not doing it. Good story. It wouldn't so. be the same without me. <laughs> do it. Sure. I uh, went orange. Uh, that's not what I called him for, but. Tough to Eiffel Tower somebody when they can't be <laughs> yeah. involved. Yeah, really weird one-on-one. -on -one. Yeah. yeah. But it, whatever, it worked sure. out. All right, that's cool. Um, no, I went over, so I ended up just changing some plans, got all of my other little odds and ends and returns and, like, you know, things like that done, and uh, went orange hunting, mm -hmm. shopping. So mm -hmm. Oranges? Yeah, went and got some new the orange produce? for November, and mm. apparently it's a little early yet. Most places only had camo, and mm. the very few of them had some options of orange. So it's not like other stores yeah. where they've already got yeah. uh, Christmas stuff on. Christmas stuff yeah. set up? Yeah. And the guy's like, yeah, no. He's like, uh, we're, we're still kind of at Shields. He's like, oh, we, st we got a little bit over here. He's like, but we really just kind of rolled out our camo. He's like, well, that's good because hunting season started a month ago. Mm -hmm. But he didn't see Not seem to mention this weekend is the youth hunt, which requires blaze orange. orange. Yeah. yeah. Um, so they actually did. I mean, they did. And finally we got over to where they keep the orange, which was completely away from the hunting stuff. Makes sense. Yeah, yeah. it was over by the bowling alley. Oh, yeah, shields. why wouldn't it be over Yeah, there? absolutely. And then they had about 12 different items to choose from. Hmm. Hmm. So, <clears throat> but I did end up finding one that will work. So, nice. not what I wanted, but it's fine. It'll work. <clears throat> Just the pants and new hat and stuff like that. So, you were looking go. for new blaze orange pants? I was actually looking for the reversible, the camo on one side, oh. blaze orange on the other. Uh, just because I needed to upgrade both, but I figured spend a little bit more on just one item mm. that would be dual purpose. But you should just get yourself some nice wool pants. I looked at some uh, the Shields Outfitter brand. They had some wool overalls, and I wanted to buy them, but the size fit, except the length. Mm -hmm. I mean, I would have had to have somebody hem a good foot, foot and a half. Jesus. I mean, it was it was outrageous. And I was like, nah, I'm not going to pay that much money. Right. And then, I mean, which my aunt, she does all that kind of stuff, so it would have been fine. But I was like, nope, that's fine. I'll just, I'll wait. Just get, a, about it. Just get a nice uh, one-piece jumper. Yeah, I'm not, I've never been into that one-piece jumper Union thing. suit? I know a guy that was, but yeah, yeah um, <laughs> I like the individual. Oh. So, so that's what I that's what I did. Huh. So what were we gonna do? What were we gonna do, fucker? <laughs> Can't tell you. Yeah, dick. Uh, All right, fuck you. Sorry, Ben. 
<laughs> Good, we didn't us. want to know anyways. No, no. Uh, nothing, nothing crazy. Yesterday we went up to um, Crex Meadows, which is kind of up in the uh, northwestern part of the state, up by the Minnesota border, up kind of go up past like Hurdle Turtle and Siren, up in that neck mm-hmm. of the woods. And it's a giant wildlife area, and it's a uh, stopping grounds for the sandhill cranes on their migration south. My boy absolutely loves birds, so we always go up there every year in the fall. And it was not in full swing, but it was rolling pretty decent. I mean, we saw, you know, a few thousand. So Really? Geez, yeah. But it, it gets way, way crazier. So, Because they have a season on those now, right? Not here. Not here. Okay. Not to my knowledge, at least. Because if they did, I would hunt them. Yeah? Yeah. They're supposed to be absolutely delicious. Yeah, well, like the flaming young of Ray the, of the sky. Yeah. Ray in the sky. Yeah, I was yeah. gonna say they were talking about that on uh, the duck call room, and then mm-hmm. they had, you know, how they had shot this sandhill crane, and then they got some backlash or whatever that it was illegal, and they're like, not here. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's against the law, to my knowledge, at least. It's against the law here, but like mm-hmm. Texas and you know down south that they have seasons on them, and yeah, huh. yep. Interesting. Yeah, but yeah. So we did that. We'll we'll probably go again late October, early November when it's full bore, full swing. But it was cool. Go up there and just went for a cruise, stopped and had a little picnic lunch, and yeah, that was about the extent of that. And then came home and watched absolute chaos unfold in the college football world. That seen a lot of highlights of oh. some some big upsets yesterday. Yeah, it was fantastic. <laughs> Yeah, the Alabama Vanderbilt game was fucking incredible. I I didn't see that part of it. I got to see the aftermath where yeah. they took the goal pole yeah, three the miles goal pulse down miles to the river <laughs> down Broadway Street or whatever the fuck it is. Yeah. Uh huh. What? Yeah. Yeah. When was it? Yesterday? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. They upset the number one. Team. Number one. Yeah. Mm-hmm. On ranked, ranked team. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but there was a lot of upsets. I mean, it was. Uh, Michigan lost, USC lost, yeah. Texas A and M lost. Yeah, it was crazy. Wisconsin won big too. Yeah, big time, fifty-two to six. Mm-hmm. With their what second string quarterback or third? Yep, second. Yep, second, I believe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's about it. Vanderbilt is in Nashville. So oh, they, oh, after they won, all the students rushed the field. Tore down, tore the, down goal the goal post and ended up taking it all the way down to downtown Nashville on Broadway where all the big bars you know, honky-tonks and, and yeah. stuff are. Where Gary Allen will never perform. <laughs> no, no, we won't. Well, they have a lot of time slots, though. He did play down there, I'll let you know. In June, I highly doubt that. Uh, June, like, 6th, I think. Were they opening was... a new payphone that he fucking paid, <laughs> played for, or <laughs> what? Uh, hmm. New phone booth, Gary Allen dedication. Wow. Jason, why don't you just three go blocks ahead. off the main strip? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> go ahead, destroyer. Well, I didn't do nothing a whole lot. <laughs> go ahead, uh, destroyer. <laughs> this week at all. Uh, went bowling on Thursday night. Um, Friday night we went to the football game. It was kind of chilly there. Mm. It got pretty chilly, and then forty. Uh, yeah, it was forty, about forty-five. Oh, yeah. It was kind of. Sh- Kind of chilly. It was. Oof. And then uh, Saturday we had uh, our competition came to town in Chippewa, so we had a bunch of other schools throughout the state come over the the music on the along river. the river, music Chippewa along, the, Chippewa. along the, whatever it's called, yeah. We did that. And How did they do? Um... Well, they were exhibition, so they didn't get. Yeah, so touched. when you, oh, yeah. they didn't compete. Right. Yeah, so when you're a home team, you usually don't get. Gotcha. Oh. Them, so. Yeah, but okay. yeah, River Falls kicked ass again, like they always do. <coughs> it seems like they're the, f- the favorite in the league. Yeah, they're. It's pretty neat to see that. And then next. Saturday we go over to what? What's oh, U.S. Bank Stadium? U.S. Bank Stadium, <laughs> and then the week after that we go down to UW Whitewater. So, fucking a. Yep. Nice. Mm-hmm. And then I found out some other news. Uh, this okay. Is, 
Is this where the <clears throat> name change comes in? Yeah. Oh, yeah. ladies and gentlemen, welcome the Destroyer. The Destroyer. So I found out something that uh, somebody had a little vacation time. Remember, we were going to find this out. Yeah. Well, it was the uh, this week. Here. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. So then uh, somebody took somebody else. <laughs> Mama. <laughs> to Mama. the zoo. Oh, yeah. I saw the pictures. Uh-huh. The pictures. Yeah. yeah. Who else huh. would go with them? I mean, I, I well, didn't get a fucking text. Didn't or I didn't bring it up. <laughs> Nothing. I actually commented to the wife. I was like, I see Nate posted a bunch of pictures at the Minnesota Zoo. And she's like, oh, really? And I was like, yeah. She's yeah. like, who did he go there with? I said, Karen and Dan. Yeah. And she's like, nobody else? I said, well, not based on the pictures that I saw. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? That's perfect. I mean, you know, I know a lot of grown adult men that just go with their mom and dad, take a day off of work. And yeah. No, but we took the whole week I off. Was, well, say, you was know. this the week? This, this was, was the week. This was the week. Yeah. Jesus yeah. Christ. Mom, yeah. let's go to the yeah, zoo. Yeah, let's go to the zoo. Yeah, come on. Did you guys That's see the exactly back seat No, no, Dan no. Drove? Dan did drive. <laughs> 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 Jesus Christ. <laughs> Well, when it's time to feed, it's time to feed. Yeah, I guess so. I yeah, mean, oh, yeah, I suppose she can jump right in the back seat. Yeah, with them not gonna and, uh, fucking pull over. <laughs> suckle up right he here. He doesn't have like a, a some sort of mechanism that just funnels the straw right into the back. <laughs> <laughs> well, not when she's right there. Uh. She, it comes right straight from the teeth. <laughs> Direct feed. Yeah. Right. <laughs> 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 Dan's up front trying to call the car straight. <laughs> Would you two fucking settle down back there? I can't yeah. keep the car uh-huh. on the road. That's right. <laughs> Ma! Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Taking Mama to the zoo. Yeah. Uh, what a nice young oh man. Oh, my he gosh. Yeah. That's why he gets the baths that he does. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, was, I looked through all the pictures. I was like, oh, it's probably, you know, like, they went with whatever the little guy's name is, you know, that you went fishing with or... Mm-hmm. You know, like maybe Chris and all of them and the kids went, or I was like, mm. I don't, I don't think I so. Don't I think know. it was just Nate and mm-hmm. Karen and Dan. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it was. Just some nice family time, though. Good for you. Yeah. So, I'm assuming it's my turn. In your forties. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> yeah. So where's the destroyer coming? That's it. Oh, you because you destroyed his. Okay. Okay. I thought there was more. No, but no, no. no. Uh. Yeah, because my mom, I asked them to come with me. So it sounds like he's going to cry. <laughs> uh. All right. Now. So, all week. You had off all week. All week, all week. Better be careful. That red phone is going to ring at Karen's house. Oh, she's uh, close uh, now. I'm sure. Not my name. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Just come charging right over here. Uh. Yep. Yeah. Just, mm. Her ears no, are probably ringing right now. They are, me? but she won't. You'll get a call tonight around seven when they listen to the episode. Oh, oh yeah. that'll be next week. Yeah, so you next, got a week before. You yeah, you got a week. Yeah. Mm. That's all right. <laughs> so anyway, Jason Lido. Yeah. Uh, listen. Yeah. We need to talk. <laughs> when you get time. Swing over. Yeah. Mm-hmm. All right. But not Sunday at 7 p.m. because you know I'll be busy. <laughs> I'm sleeping at that time. <laughs> well, not this Sunday. You're not. You're going to get a spanking. Mm. Oh. I put my phone on silent and I go to bed. I don't give a shit. Because yeah. mm. um, when the alarm goes off, it goes off. Yeah. And then I get up, I hear it. So and anything else you guys text and shit after 7 o'clock, I don't respond. Mm. Yeah, we know. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's all good. I do cringe sometimes though, because I didn't realize you put your phone on silent. I didn't know you knew how to put your phone on silent. <laughs> <laughs> so I sometimes cringe when a message comes in at seven thirty, eight o'clock. I'm like, oh, Jason's probably sleeping. But now that I know it's on silent, I'll actually respond back. Sometime. No, Light Light up. Up. I don't Light care. Up. I'm no, I'm sleeping. So wake up to sixty text messages. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'll start. I'll start calling you fuckers when I get up. That'd be fine. Yeah, I, suppose, okay. I suppose you do the same thing. My phone set. My phone is set to do not disturb from mm-hmm. nine p.m. to five a.m. Oh, well, that sucks. Except for my emergency contacts, they can get through. Oh, that's, we're not an emergency hoping, contacts. No, you're sure not. Oh, I'm heartbroken. <laughs> I'm saddened. Yeah, sorry. 
<laughs> what if we had an emergency podcast? We had we have an emergency podcast. Get over here, we need quick. To, <laughs> quick, we need to record. What's the emergency? You ran out of buttermilk or what? <laughs> We're going to do the buttermilk bath. Oh, challenge. Buttermilk, buttermilk <laughs> bath challenge. <Yep. laughs> we could start a new TikTok go viral. With that. <laughs> buttermilk. Let me buy stock in buttermilk first, though. <laughs> we, we can do it for the podcast. He can do the podcast when he's getting his buttermilk. Oh, yeah. yeah. Mm. Waterproof mics. Do we have to blur part of the screen? If, I would imagine. Yeah. Not a lot of it. I no, would that's true. Yeah. Like a pixel. Yeah. You know. Does Karen have to sign an agreement to agree to be part of that? or A non-compete or something? There? <laughs> There's nobody competing with that. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Uh, hmm. So what'd you do, Nate? So I had the week off. Oh, Whoa. what'd you do? Well, yeah, don't do tell any of your buddies that you got the week off. That was you know? precisely why. Mm-hmm. What'd you do with your seventh full it's week? It's not off like this we year. had to fucking work or nothing. We, it's not like. Well, yeah. God, I'd hate to get together with a buddy and go get mm-hmm. lunch or, or do something. Sure. You yeah. know, go grab some dinner. Yeah. You know, fuck. Well, it turns out that I wasn't really around much anyway because, um, so, uh, as was alluded to earlier, I went to the zoo. Hmm. <laughs> Who'd you go with? <laughs> my mom. Mama. Oh, mama. <laughs> um, well, I had, as, well, you guys know I was trying to keep it under wraps of when this week was because I wanted to do absolutely nothing. But at the same time, I wanted to have, like, one day doing something kind sure. of fun. Yeah. And that was what I think fun. You think the zoo? Yep. So I like... Which zoo? Minnesota. Minnesota, obviously. Oh. So you know I like animals more than most people. So. Yeah. Yeah. And I wanted to go see them. So I was like, I'll send them a message and see if they want to go with me. Well, then, of course, it turns out that they're gonna drive because I, yeah you can't oh i would have probably they both would have just been sitting just tense riding with me so then uh, fine that's fine so instead of taking the know, lexus well it's a porsche but or instead whatever. of t- <laughs> um instead of taking 94 to minneapolis you know like we normally would we took Highway 12 to Highway 10 to 63. To highway 8. County Road yeah. and three neighbors farm field. Yeah. Instead of it Fucking taking curves. 90 minutes, it took oh, yeah. 9.4 hours. It was, yeah, it increased it by almost, Seven I think days. it was almost an hour. <laughs> it was 45 minutes to an hour longer. So, yeah, it was a... But man, just longer. think of all that extra time he got mm. fucking milking. <sighs> milking the maid, so yeah. to speak. Dried but, up. Yeah, yeah, shit. Karen probably came back. Clothes falling off her. Oh, I, hope you, I hope you brought some Gatorade for her. <laughs> Dehydrated. Yeah, Dehydrated. Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> like, a, like a fishy kissing. <laughs> That. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> so what day was that on? <laughs> oh, ben, Ben's gone. Yeah. Ben's broken. He's <laughs> <laughs> broken. Are you full yet? <laughs> Uh, oh, does geez. she burp you then too or? <laughs> she's, she's got good. the strength <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was Thursday <laughs> yeah thirsty Thursday that, yep, makes, that sense. makes sense yeah um, Tuesday though I went down went down to Milwaukee and uh, was able to do a little uh, I don't know stroll along stroll along the shoreline they actually have a pretty neat well, pretty nice beaches down there so got some pictures down there and got the the water and climbed up on some rocks and got to play oh, around easy, down there. Yeah. easy. Mm-hmm. might slip and fall well, Did Ma go with you then no. Too? Oh. no she was busy on tuesday <laughs> yeah so i did that tuesday wednesday <laughs> she was front loading for those <laughs> tuesday she was prepping yeah <laughs> 
yeah, making snack. up snack packs. Mm -hmm. Tuesday, Wednesday was Milwaukee, and then Wednesday, uh, Tuesday, Wednesday was Milwaukee. Thursday was in Minneapolis, and then Friday. Recovery. Oh, uh, well, no, it was, it was the opposite, opposite of recovery. I went down, Downtown. met some met some friends down at a local watering hole. Oh, the one where you don't know everyone? Yeah. That yeah. you just yelled at me for? Right. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I didn't see anybody down there with the black watch on. And it was no, white. it was a white. Oh, white watch. See, yeah. I was looking for the wrong guy. Yeah, well, but he was probably working his 12. Hmm. That could be. Hmm. And then yesterday I went up to the marching on the Chippewa or mar music along the Chippewa. Mm -hmm. Nice. And today I got up bright and early, 8 o'clock, and got ready to watch the Viking game. So There we go. Like it. Yeah. So... Should we do an email? We've yeah. got one. Ooh. Ooh. I like emails. I'm not sure I do. Ooh. I uh -oh. do. You're not sure if you like it? I'm not sure if I like this one yet. Hmm. So this is from the guy that tried to... I got mail! Yay! I got mail! Yay! So this guy doesn't live too far from me. Mm. One day I saw, uh, he was driving by and it looked like his house was on fire. Mm. <laughs> so I sent him a message just to make sure. And he's like, no, no, I'm just grilling. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah. But you'll understand why I had to take a shot at him. Because when I read this, you'll, you'll know. Remember, him. he's probably within shooting distance of you, though. <laughs> yeah, but just so that he knows, he remind, remind him that I won a nine, won a nine millimeter. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. That would be more threatening if you knew how to run it. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever buy any powder for it? No. Nah. No, you don't. You gotta throw it at the guy? You don't need that. <clears throat> you so just show him. It's just enough of a threat. Sometimes it's all it You takes. just pull up your shirt. Thank you. If, uh, <laughs> if somebody sees me with a gun... <laughs> They know it's a water gun. They're yeah. going to know that it... Well, they're, I think they're going to just be, like, scared as it is. They'd probably be more scared for me, but... I yeah. Think it'll be scary enough for anybody that's around, so... Mm -hmm. I don't think I need bullets in it. Okay. All right. Hey, Hicks. Hi. I am in need of some fatherly advice. Oh, you came to the right place, buddy. Mm -hmm. Sounds like his wife is really smart. <laughs> My wife is a Vikings fan, oh. and she is... Yeah. You guys are going to clap? Yeah. All right. Um, and she is trying to turn our four-month-old into a Viking fan yes. as well. Yes. I don't see where the need for advice yep. comes in. It sounds maybe like maybe it's just read the email. Seems oh. to figure it out. <laughs> How do I stop this from happening? Do I go out for milk and not come home? <laughs> mm. Although I am not a huge football fan myself, I don't know if I could live with myself if my kid was a Vikings fan. Hell, it's almost as bad as being a Gary Allen fan. Mm. <laughs> Ain't that the fucking truth? Mm -hmm. There's about to be some more smoke coming uh. from his house here. <laughs> Get the wife and kid out. <laughs> um, so what's your advice? I mean, do you guys have advice? Find a new wife. <laughs> wow. there That's straight go. to the point. Wow. Yeah. Um, Don't sugarcoat it. <laughs> I mean, uh, at this stage, if if he's really not a football fan, then yeah, he doesn't have a whatever. That he doesn't, doesn't mean care. he doesn't have common sense. Well, he doesn't I mean, seem it, to care though. Obviously, he's got enough fucking common sense to not be a fan of the most pathetic fucking team in all of professional sports. That are 5-0? and all? Yeah, the team with the best that record. That doesn't mean they're a fucking great team or you want to be a fan of them. Whoa, okay. I'm a, yeah, well, wait I don't a know second. about all that. No, so because that's, the not Packers, to mention the fact that you live in fucking Wisconsin. Yeah, we're closer. Not to, the fucking puke state of Minnesota. We're closer. Eh, eh. We're closer to Minneapolis than we are to Green Bay. What does that have to do with anything? I cheer for the local fucking team. Price it's not the I... local team. The local team is a Wisconsin-based mm -hmm. team. <sighs> local. Yeah. I I think uh, I think you just let that one be, and you pick uh, the MLB team the kid plays cheers for. You know, I could I can go with Brewers on that. Being that Brewers he guy. doesn't care really, it sounds like about football. Just embrace it, right? Psh. Buy her every fucking Packer thing you can buy her, and just be done with it. Hmm. Tell your wife to hit the bricks. 
Mm, okay. <laughs> Listen, lady. <laughs> there ain't going to be Listen, no more Linda. than one fucking purple ding dong eater in this house. <laughs> <laughs> only uh, one. Okay. Yes. Well, <clears throat> first of all, the kid's only four months old. Right. They don't know nothing. Well, about. yeah, you got to hope that she's going to have enough common sense when she gets older to cheer for the correct team. And that's what's going to happen right. anyway. Right. So Hope that she got more dad jeans than mom jeans. Right, yeah. So I wouldn't worry about the... That's true. Not, not yet. I yeah, mean... That's a good point. They don't know. So I would just wait, and they'll wisen up, and they'll say, mm. fucking Vikings. Well, especially once they see, like... <sighs> Here's a team that does good, the yeah, Packers. Packers, mm-hmm. right? Here's a team that fucking blows Chow. Yeah, Vikings. The Vikings. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Here's a team that's five and zero. Oh. Here's yeah. a team that's two and two. Yeah. And how many seasons in a row have you guys fucking? Oh, uh, we're living in the now. Yeah. Your okay. crow at the right beginning now. of the year. The kid's four months old. Only to be fucking crying in your buttermilk at the end of the season. <laughs> I mean, he's, every one of them. So yeah. Far. The kid's every only four one. months old. Yeah, never seen yeah. a better team. Yeah. yeah. Currently. Yep. Currently, you gotta in, ride that wave. In their lifetime, they have never seen a better team than the Vikings. Right. Yep. So sure. All yeah. right. So that answers uh, that. Yeah. Go get them. Yeah. They'll wisen up. Yeah. Another topic of discussion. Ooh. Hmm. Go to weeknight meals. Mm-hmm. Um, and go to winter meals once the grill is put away. The grill the is grill never put away. Get put away. Oh, see, well. <laughs> I told you is about him uh, having it looking like his house is on fire. That's so maybe true. it's better that his grill is put away. No, you can grill all year long. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, yeah. Absolutely. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You don't yeah. need to put it away, Jake. Well, uh-huh. at that time, I would say sandbar for dinner on Wednesdays. Well, uh, and then the rest of the week, just honestly, the, the crock pot comes into play. Chili. <sighs> Chili's fine. Make sure. Chili. Have you ever um, made chili? I. I think we talked about this yeah, once. Champ, I was like he's a, a champ or something. Yeah. Back to back, back to back years, years uh, chili contest. Mm-hmm. Nice. I don't remember that. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah, we talked about it. I true. believe you. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, I just crock pots and roast. Make a roast. Yeah, roast are good. Yeah. yeah. Mississippi pot roast is a big winner. The what? What is it? Mississippi pot roast. Okay. Is that raccoon and skunk and? No, it's a chuck roast. Oh. But you put it in a crock pot with uh, like a half stick of butter, uh, ranch seasoning packet, a packet of uh, like au jus gravy mix, some pepperoncini peppers, and beef broth, if I remember correctly. Mm -hmm. Maybe not even the beef broth. But yeah, it's the best roast. It's Mm. awesome. So I always found this, uh, it was a packet, I think it was Campbell's. It was like a liquid gel thing, and it's a uh, tavern pot roast or tavern-style pot roast, and you put that in with it. And nothing, well, you could put baby carrots, mushrooms, whatever. Onions. Yep. Uh, well, you can, yeah. But uh, that was top-notch Easy. there. And I let that go for about eight hours and just mm, enjoy it. Eat it. Yep. Look up Mrs. Google Mississippi Pot Roast. It's the best pot roast you'll make. It's very, very good. Hmm. And I know a lot of people do, it seems like more and more that I see, like it's in a crock pot or you can put it in an oven. A lot of people do things with like shredded chicken. They Mm -hmm. add, you know, a dozen different things or a dozen different recipes and it all is just shredded chicken. And it, yeah, like if you have a Costco membership, five bucks for a giant rotisserie chicken, Mm -hmm. bring it home, shred it up, and you can. There's a billion different things you can do with it. But what I've actually been doing lately is I'll buy a, a family pack of chicken quarters from Wally World or whatever, grill them, and then shred it, and then just use that all week for tacos, quesadillas, whatever, billion different things. Nice. Hmm. And it's you can get a family pack of those chicken quarters for like $7. They're stupid cheap. Hmm. Yep. What do you go to in the fall, winter? Dumplings, more dumplings. I mm. I like that. Uh, it's I think it's a Tyson. I think it's at Wally World. It's chicken. No, it's uh, beef. Oh. oh. And you put it in the crock pot, and everything is right there. You just it has onions and carrots in it. it oh, the ones in. that pre wrapped. Yeah, that's pre Yeah, them are nice. Yep. Mm. And you put that in there and turn it on in the morning. And when you come home, it's done. That's really really good. 
Yeah. I did that the last time I made dumplings, actually. Yeah. With that roast? Yeah, with that roast. And it oh. comes with the red potatoes in yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, it's really good. For 20 bucks, it feeds all of us. So. Yeah. And you can make that. croissants. And yeah, it's good. Croissant. Croissant. Nice. Mm-hmm. Uh, keep up the good work. You bring light and laughter to a Monday morning. Hey. Oh, hey all right. Well, nice. we are glad to be a Thank part you. of your Monday yes. morning. Yes. Yeah. Thanks for the email. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. So now, Mr. Destroyer, <coughs> you want to tell us what some words mean? Oh. Yeah. What's that acronym? Dun, dun, dun. Jason's favorite. I, I don't think I got any right so far, have I? Yeah, that one week you had like three or four of them. Oh, right really? There's yeah. definitely been some that you... You've started to know, or you, uh, one of the See, what, what did we leave off with last time? Was it AARP? Yep. Okay. We did that one. Here's one for you, Jason. DHS. Ooh. DHS. Oh, I think I might even know. Well, well there's a couple different things that this yeah. could be. Is it the the moving company or whatever? No, it's no, DHL. This is, this is oh, not that's DHL. <laughs> not that. Uh, there, I think it's... Uh, if this place has an office, this one has one, what are each of those called? Cubes. Okay. Um. <laughs> in a in a store, you got the... Department. M- yeah, there you go. Okay. Okay. And that... <coughs> we Coughs. could do like, what is this? Uh, <laughs> or really healthy today. <clears throat> just tell them. Yeah, you might as well just tell me. You know, what's the second one? Department of Home Security. Okay. Well, no. Homeland. Home. Homeland Security, yeah. that's one of them. Yep. Yeah. That's what this one is? Oh, that, that would be one, yeah. Yep. Are you yep. sick today? No, I'm not sick. You feeling me. good? Oh, yeah. Which means you're... Healthy. Okay. Without the L-Y, maybe. Health. Okay. Department of Health Security I Systems. Think, I don't think the security part is... There's a Department of Human Services. Oh, yeah. That's like your... Yep. Well, so which one do you got? I said Department of Homeland Security. Oh, that is the one. Okay. Yeah. Hey, good. good Look job. at them all. Good yeah. job. All valid answers. One yeah. for one. Good yeah. job. Good job. Right. This was a gimme. <laughs> FBI. Federal Bureau of Investigation. Nice job. Well done. Yay. Uh, the next one is FEMA. F-E-M-A. Mm. Yeah, that's when a tornado or hurricane comes through, and those guys show up about... Two weeks, weeks late, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Unless you're in another country. Those guys. Hey, yeah. uh, oh, yeah. Patty, Patty and Trevor through. has been uh, eight or nine days eight, without nine power days, now. Yeah. Sure have. Yeah, their food's going to be spoiled. It's actually in their garbage can. Is it? Yeah, yeah, it should be by now, yeah, I guess. Yeah, on Thursday. Oh. I, just, I just talked to him last night, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Um, I don't know what it stands for, but... Federal they, Emergency Medical... Management. Assistance agency. Fuck. Federal emergency management agency. So wouldn't the emergency be like quickly? Yeah, like when yeah. it just ended. Yeah. But yeah. don't worry, we're not on Ben's list. Okay. <laughs> don't call him if you got an emergency. Like, don't call me. They should just quickly change the name and they'll to a different country and they'll. When we show up, we show billions up. Billions there. When we show up, we show up. Help. <laughs> yeah. All right, the next get one. To you. Yeah, we'll get to you. Uh, it relates to college football. Oh, mm. God. S E C. I heard this one this week, too. Mm. I don't know. S E C. Southeastern uh, Conference. Okay. And now keep in, keep in mind <laughs> what Florida. that one was. That's Florida. Yeah. This also <clears throat> is college football. A C C. Uh, American East. Oh, uh, no, there's no E in it. Oh, I don't know. ACC. <clears throat> not the Pacific, but the... Atlantic. Coast. Not the shore, but the... <laughs> oh, my God, you guys. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Atlantic Coast Conference. Oh, okay. Yeah. I didn't know there was this many. 
Well, there's more. That's, there's yeah. way more than that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Pac- Paxton, some of them are, yeah. We, yeah. Some of them I just watch Wisconsin. And there's the Big Ten where there's 25 teams in yeah. it. You know. Yeah, lots of Pac-12. And mm-hmm. there's a lot. And I think that's, the that's five, so that'll be everything for today. Mm-hmm. Now you know. Hmm. Yeah, you got a couple. Yeah, well done. Not bad. Moving up in the world. Ah. Well, I try. Good job. Yeah, uh, Patty and I was talking to him last night, and um, she said that they were talking to the power company that was there in the neighborhood. Yeah. And there's over 6,000 poles that have to be repaired Holy or replaced. Holy shit, no kidding. And well, that shouldn't that, take long. I don't know if she meant that was the whole South Carolina or their, their county, town, county, town mm. what it was. But, yeah, they were hoping to have it Friday, and then they were hoping to have it Saturday, and still nothing she said hmm. and it's hmm. 90 well, oh they, boy they must have cell coverage then they do yep well service yeah whatever right now well, but i mean at least that's do they have a generator of some sort nothing. they don't that. have any of that so she said that oh. they uh they have some well i take that back i don't know what it is some kind of a battery source something that they can charge their phones and a little oh. battery fan mm. um and then they just they'll go out and run the car for a little while to charge something if they need it um and she said they'll snack throughout the day because they don't have fridges or freezers right, yeah um and then they'll go out to a restaurant at night to have a nice dinner cool down because they have ac in those parts yeah and then she said they come home and it's still like 80s and 90s at night Oof. F? Yeah. no but they get to go back to work tomorrow she mm. said oh. and she works from home it sounded like but since there's no power <coughs> she is going to go to work with trevor and use mm. one of his offices mm. so she said it'll be nice but they were their situation is a little little bit better than others because they're on the city's sewer and water mm-hmm. so all that's working like mm. a lot of their neighbors have must be wells and septics wells. Huh. they don't have yeah well, facilities power maybe not to the pumps or what are the well pumps yeah or? so i i don't know, know all that but yeah, she said it's a lot different. Well, at least you could take a shower and shit. You right, know, yeah, and she said she, natural gas is still working because they have hot yeah. water. Yeah. So, but yeah, hmm. it's quite the thing. Hmm. Crazy. Yeah. So, I, uh, uh, you know, I had last week, this whole last week off of work. So, Monday and Tuesday must have been your free days to so just lay around, sleep in, door well, dash. No, Monday... <clears throat> I don't know. I yeah, I just kind of laid around. Tuesday, no, I left for Milwaukee. But oh. um, so I was off all last week. This week, I go to work on Monday, but I have to leave at three. On Tuesday, I go to work until I think one thirty, and then I have a offsite conference meeting thing until three thirty. But then when I'm done in with that at three thirty, then I gotta drive down to. Rothschild, Schofield, Rothschild, Wausau, I don't know, somewhere. Wausau's over. Somewhere just south. Is it Marathon County? No, I don't. One of the counties over there, and then I'll be gone the rest of the week. Doing <laughs> nothing. We'll be conferencing. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, so big two week stretch for you. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. I'm not in the office much these last two weeks. Well, I remember that in November. <laughs> Not <laughs> up for election in November, <laughs> but hmm. um, do you guys got some news? Yes. <clears throat> so I have a couple actual articles and then a couple things I just was going to bring up. We've talked about AI on here before, as Jason would like to say, artificial insemination. Right. Um, I thought this was kind of crazy. I l- listened to. Uh, <laughs> video clip where a guy was talking about AI and this was supposedly almost two years ago um, when AI was really like coming about pretty heavy they they wanted to test AI and like what it was really capable of so they took their AI and they they told it that it needed to access uh, this one website and at the the front of the website is the captcha to stop bots, right? Mm-hmm. So, which is specifically designed to stop bots. So the AI 
could not get around that, but it was smart enough that um, have you ever heard of different apps like Fiverr or different things like that where you can pay somebody a couple bucks to do something for you? Mm-hmm. So the the AI went on to Fiverr and, and contacted a live human being and said, hey, I need to access this website, but I can't get past the bot filter. Can you please help me? Mm. And the person actually came back and said, why can't you get past the bot filter, you know, thinking that they were a bot? And AI came back with, I apologize. I have very poor eyesight. Um, wow. My prescription lenses are broken, and I can't use them to get past it. Damn. Would you be able to help? And the person did, and they were able to. Like, huh. that's, like, legit scary. Yeah. Yeah. That they, they were able to troubleshoot that, can, come up with a lie. Manipulate like the, the system. Yeah. Jeez. So we're the, doomed, is what you're saying. Yeah. Yeah, we're, eventually. We're, we're doomed. Yeah. Yep. Good it's news for your AI girlfriend, though. Uh, yeah. She's going to yeah, tell lies yeah. about where she's been. Woo. Oof. Easy. I'm um, confused on the bot. <laughs> the bot? The robot. Robot. Oh. <laughs> it's like a bot fly. Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> Right. You got it. <laughs> oh, fucking Grace, this is what I'm talking about. Just say the fucking word, dude. Oh. Robots. They don't that's a Couldn't get past the bot. Well it's not it's not like a physical robot like you would think of. Bot is just another phrase for uh like software that, that people can make to data mine on the internet or do like numerous different things on the internet. Okay. So, like, lots of times when you get spam emails or, like, those are bots sending those out. It's not You'd like... you have to get an email. Yeah. We'll just leave it at that. It was okay. A okay. It's a robot. <laughs> no need to go in depth. Yeah, yeah it's, it's a robot. It's R2-D2. It's, uh, it's Short a great, circuit. Yep, yeah. It's just like C-3PO and Star Wars. Same thing. Yep. Okay. I don't even know who that is. It's oh. a short circuit. It's a, yeah, yeah, short circuit. Okay. Yeah. Number so five, like, stay alive. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Good. We're good. Uh, so I thought this was interesting. There is a. This is all in proposals right now, but apparently it's pretty close to happening. There is a 1,200 mile underwater bullet train um, that the UAE, United Arab Emirates, uh, so like Dubai over there. Okay. Oil money. Yeah. Got mm-hmm. it. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Um, that's going to connect the metropolis of Dubai with Mumbai, India. So it's it's still in development. Like, they haven't actually started construction or anything on it. But it's going to go under the ocean. Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's going to run along the ocean floor in, a like, a tube or whatever you want to say, a tunnel that's constructed. It's going to span 1,200 miles. And right now, they think that it will, will be able to travel... At 600 to 1,000 kilometers an hour will be the max speed of this thing, which is like five to 600 miles an hour. That's fast. Nice. Well, I guess not five to six. 1,000 kilometers an hour, I think, is roughly yeah. 500 miles an hour. Yeah, ballpark-ish. Still. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. And what is the purpose to going to India? Just- there are two giant trade centers. Okay. And that would um, be for people or yep, goods? or I think both, yes. But huh. but part of the reason that this is more likely to come to fruition is um, that same underwater tunnel, they're also going to run oil and, uh, like, fiber internet. And sure. So, like, it's more than just for people, you know what I mean? It'll be able to be used for all that. But the whole thing is supposedly going to be made out of glass. So you can run this train... And watch, you know, you'll be on the bottom of the ocean floor, and there'll be fish fucking. Oh, so it's not going to be like in the crust or nothing. It's no, just no, gonna it's going to be in like the water, on, like yeah, on the in bottom, the water on the, floor, on the bottom. Yeah. Yep. Huh. yep. But how deep is that? I mean, yeah, I don't know how deep the water is there, but miles, isn't it? I would assume not. That'd be pretty difficult for construction. Yeah, right, that's what I was. Yeah, can't be that deep. Right. We'll have to find out. Yeah, I don't know, but I just I thought that was. I mean, 
how cool would it be to just take that just to see the ocean from the bottom? Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. that'd be pretty slick. I do believe he has a picture of a stingray from uh, one of those glass things when he went with mom over to the <laughs> really? city. Uh, <laughs> You so yeah, that's what it probably looked like. Would that be? Would I be accurate on that? Yeah. Okay. Did you know? <laughs> so uh, when you when you see a <laughs> when you see a stingray from the bottom, they have like their two eyes and they have a little face. It looks like they're smiling. And really? It's on the bottom of them. Yeah. On the bottom, it's adorable. Because that would be where their mouth is. Right on the bottom. Right, but it's adorable. Oh, okay. I'll bring up a picture and I'll or I'll send a picture over and I'll okay. show you. Whatever. <laughs> Did you not know that before you went to the zoo? Yeah. Oh, okay. I just thought it was really cool. <laughs> You're right. Ma was holding his hand? No. <laughs> she was getting rehydrated. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. For the ride home. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. She, <laughs> she was just standing over by the fire hydrant with the hose <laughs> coming off of it. Just... <laughs> 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 huh. I gotta get fueled back up for my baby. <laughs> yeah, walking around, <laughs> fuck clothes hanging off her, looking like she haven't ate fucking six months. <laughs> Cheeks all sunk in. <laughs> uh, anything for my Nathan? Um, mm-hmm. while I'm waiting to get this pulled up, I th- I just found this interesting. This kind of goes along with news, but it's not because it has to do with Jason. But so you told me yesterday you kind had you had something for the first time, like was it yeah. y- yesterday or yeah. a couple days ago? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Share that. It was Share ta- that. It was uh, Taco Bell. For the first time ever. First time ever. Wow. I'm what? not a fan. What? Oh. Taco Bell. Where the fuck have you been? I don't. I never, never had been. Taco Bell before. Wow. What'd you have? What'd it do to you? Yeah. Um, it gave me a fucking heartburn and it made me have to shit real bad. So to be fair though, almost that's everybody. everything you eat makes you have to shit real bad. Oh yeah, I know. Well, but Taco Bell is specifically is does that to most everybody. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I prefer Taco John's. Way much better. So you've yeah. had Taco John's but you've never had Taco Bell. Uh, correct. We don't have a Taco Bell in this town till well. The one by festival when yeah, that opens up. You don't up. have to get on a fucking flight to go yeah, to Eau Claire. D- yes, fair, very fair point, Chad. Like, I'm sure you've spent time in Eau Claire in your life. Well, you're right. Yeah. I'm not at Taco Bell till yesterday or the day before, whatever day it was. Some Saturday. Okay. That's fair. Mm-hmm. What What did you have? I just had two, uh, three soft shell burritos. Or tacos, three mm-hmm. tacos, and uh, you didn't get any of the crunch or anything with that. Just a uh, meat, well, cheese, and see when I went in there, it said it was. I think it was a number two or whatever. It was supposed to be three soft shell tacos, but uh, when you had to order because those people don't talk to you at all, they don't even acknowledge you're even in the fucking store. So well, we had to. Inside. So we had to order it through. Our own, uh, so yeah, that's that's yeah, the smiley face. It's a stingray. Yeah. <laughs> do they don't have anybody at the counter? You just have to do like the. Well, see, I don't know what was going on back there because it sounded like they were really having some kind of an argument, <laughs> like legit. And uh, I was gonna go back and stand at the counter and say, uh, "There are customers out here," so paper down a little bit because there were some other words that were going on that shouldn't have been going on back there i mean they're real professional grade people so were you being helped by negative there was not a single so how did you order kaylee (laughs) how did she order she just started pushing fucking buttons on the computer screen so i was at a taco bell recently uh, while when i was down in milwaukee and (laughs) Excuse I me. think I was in Milwaukee, um, but the one down there, it was you. Um, you don't get to talk to anyone at the counter. It's all done on like There's a kiosk. The kiosk thing. So yeah. You enter your order and yep. pay with your card. And yeah, interesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not uh, very good. I, I I don't hardly ever, very rarely eat at Taco Bell, but uh, their Crunch Wrap is uh, real good. 
Mm. I'd recommend that over a soft shell burrito. I think Speaking I'm just going to Speaking of weeknight dinners, uh, Jake, homemade crunch wraps, delicious and super easy to make at your house. Hmm. I like a I like a Taco Bell here and there. Hmm. I like I'm just going to stick uh, with Taco John's because then you can put those potato olays, which are fucking mm-hmm. excellent, yeah, but you and you put them right in that. Taco that's why you get the oh, one that has it already make inside that. of it. Yep, yeah, it's in there. Yeah, but you're crunchy right. chicken potato Taco burrito. Well, yeah, but you get. I don't want chicken in it. Well, then you can get it substitute with the beef. Beef yeah. or steak, whichever you would like. Oh, but I didn't know that. It's called a meat and potato burrito. Yeah, mm. but I'm with seven. I'm with something. him on that one though. When they put them in there, like pre-made with them in there, mm. they're not as crispy and crunchy because they start getting soggy. Soggy. So when you add them yourself, crunchy. Right as you eat it, it's crunchy. No. It is. Yeah. Have mm. you ever had the Taco John's breakfast burritos? Um, no, I'm way at work before I even understand Taco that, John's but on the weekend. Bacon no. and one, I think mm. I had once. They are the best fast food breakfast you can get. Mm. Scrambled eggs, bacon, potato olays, cheese sauce, and a burrito. The cheese sauce is good. Yeah. yeah. Uh, when I go to Taco Bell, I uh, you have apparently never experienced their nacho fries. Oh, I yeah. know. And I think it would change your thought on, not that the potato rounds aren't good. They are good. But the nacho fries... They don't are, have those at Taco Bell. What? The potato rolls. rolls? No, I know. Yeah. But I'm saying yeah. compared to the Taco John's... They're called yes. potato lays. Their yeah, nacho potato fries lays. are... See, I don't like nacho cheese. Good. And it seems like Taco Bell puts nacho cheese on every single burrito, taco, crunch wrap, everything. These don't have nacho cheese on them. I don't like that. I don't like nacho cheese. Are you talking liquid stuff, or are you talking like Doritos nacho cheese? Well, no, I don't like. I mean, I'll eat dur- nacho cheese Doritos. Okay, that's. But right. I don't like the liquid nachos, yeah. right? But yeah, their their nacho fries are like Dorito flavor on the outside of the French fry. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So good. interesting. They're pretty so good. good. Yeah, I don't think. I mean, cheese isn't meant to be spicy. I don't think. That might be the most Wisconsin phrase I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> Not meant to be spicy. Like, that's a that's spicy. a very much a Midwest spicy. take. Yeah, and I'm not a spicy guy. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. I'm, I mean, I'm pepper, a when it comes pepper to jack spice, is one thing, but natural cheese, no, no. <clears throat> so you're not going to attempt to go to the new one? No, I, well, I will, but I mean, it's going to be the same. Try a crunch wrap. Yeah, try something different. Try a crunch wrap supreme. I guess I'm pretty good. Soft shell, tortilla, mm-hmm. ground beef, lettuce, tacos, or um, lettuce, tomato, sour cream. Then they put a crispy tostada. Then they wrap the burrito all the way around it, and then you, then it gets like fried. So it's yeah. oh, real eat good. Eat it like a burrito. Like a stuffed pizza almost. Yeah, like yeah. a personal sized pizza. Yep. Mm. But it's all taco and stuff. Yeah. It's good. They're good. Try it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Thank me later. So I had something interesting uh, <laughs> I stumbled across online. This isn't a news story, but it made me laugh pretty hard. It's from the city of Kenosha. And I didn't do any research to see if this is a parody account. I, I kind of have to feel like it probably is, but. Either way, yeah, there you go, Jason. Crunch wrap yeah. supreme. Uh, this this made me laugh pretty hard. The city of Kenosha posted um, this on their Facebook page in March. Do you have a hole that needs to be filled? The city of Kenosha takes public safety very seriously, which is why we're excited to launch our new hashtag, show us your hole, public safety initiative Mm. (laughs) to participate simply send us a picture of your hole along with its location and the tagline come fill my hole (laughs) and we will dispatch our crews to service your hole in a prompt and professional manner your satisfaction is our number one priority (laughs) and then and then on june 4th they they had another post our hashtag show us your hole public safety initiative was a big success and spread far and wide Mm. leaving our crews exhausted Mm. (laughs) we learned that not only does our city have an abundance of holes in need of filling 
we also have an abundance of volunteers willing to service set holes. <laughs> In order to streamline our service coordination, our IT, Jason, that's another acronym for you, information technology, Whoa. our IT department has developed a location-based app where citizens can upload a photograph of their hole and be connected with a nearby volunteer. We call the app Filler, and it will be available for iPhone and Android later this month. <laughs> well, if that's true and legit, I hope Chippewa gets on board. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so a couple weeks ago, the, that guy that sent me of that sent that picture in of me sitting on that bucket at work, yeah. mm-hmm. he was reading a... Uh, uh something a news thing article like that where people have been complaining about filling the potholes and whatever one guy took some spray paint and started spray painting penises around the holes so he put like big penises around the hole well he said it didn't take very long before those and they had to they, do something about it yeah yep. mm. but then Somebody found out who was doing it, and they got uh, destruction of property yeah, or sure, yeah. whatever it was Man called. Or, yeah, yeah, but yeah. the holes got filled, and he goes, "I'm glad I did it because they had to be worked. something had to do." Yeah, it worked. Hmm. There you go. So he tells me that almost every day to start <laughs> spray painting penises around the holes, and then they'll get the puddles filled up. Well, hmm. there you go. Mm-hmm. It's time to start carrying some spray paint in your truck. There you I go. think so. I'm glad the city did a nice job uh, from leaving the here into town on Canal. Yeah. Finally. Yeah. I mean, that, last year it was. Yeah, that was bad. Was almost impassable. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It was it bad. It was bad. Yeah. Now they, and they even fixed the two the dips there. fuck ups they. Yeah. All around that corner? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. They, one and guy was, Joel was measuring th- without his shoes on, I think, when they were looking at it. Joel was telling me about that after it was done. Mm-hmm. He said that he wasn't happy with the way it. Turned out, so they got to just finish where they ended off and then come Keep up going. to the bridge. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> where does that? I wonder where that turns into Haley's problem. Right where the they new stuff it? starts. Oh. Yeah, when you get across that bridge uh, and then the, that new uh, blacktop starts. That's where Haley starts. They can go all the way right up to there. That'd be fine too. Because <laughs> that that one mile stretch. I don't know why they didn't finish it. But they could have done that too. Right. Mm. All right. Cool. So. <clears throat> we're gonna get a rating today Ooh. yeah we do this is five star for sure five, all day oh, long day. Yeah. All five day. star well there was knowledge so news. yeah i guess we got knowledge mm-hmm. we got news we got destroyed we got a whole bunch of stuff yep. today. not all of us got destroyed yep. a bunch of us there is one thing though i want to say since we are in october mm-hmm. um and there are people that listen right y- yeah okay so we have people that listen <laughs> i hope so um they could maybe Seven. send in some emails of something scary that oh, happened, uh, a dream oh, easy. Or, easy. or a nightmare or whatever the hell it is. Did have, you but see they the, could uh, send uh, stories in. Did you see the picture I sent you or the shirt that I sent you the link to? No, maybe uh, not. We'll have to talk after we get off the air. Yeah. Because I got a couple of... Uh, scary things that happened to you? Uh-huh. Really? Oh. Yeah. Right oh. in, in that old house that I lived in. Wow. Yep. Oh. Scary. Hmm. It is. All right. And then some are not so scary, but you're not going to like them because it involves where you like to go hunting. Oh, I'm not worried. Mm-hmm. Oh. Fuck it. Yeah, mm-hmm. right. This guy's already scary. Yeah. He's just going down to Shields after the show. He's taking his orange back. Oh, now you're not going to go hunting. Return it. No, it doesn't matter. It's go. not... It wasn't during gun season. It was oh, bow hunting. Oh, oh, oh. It was bow hunting anyway. See, they get hmm. scared and they leave the area. Sure. Uh-uh. Yeah. Uh-uh. Is it a little news break or a little cliffhanger? Is it have to do with aliens? Nope. Oh, good. Not aliens. Sure, they scare me. Uh-uh. <laughs> this is a real deal that happened. I'm though. sure it's fucking real life. Real So, yeah, life. if you guys have any uh, something paranormal or whatever happened to you, send yeah. it in. Spooky. Tell us a story. Yeah, that'll be good. And then we'll have a Halloween episode. Yeah, Halloween. Oh, I, I can't like I can't wait for Halloween anyway. Do you like sure. Halloween? I don't. Oh, okay. But, uh, I love it. <laughs> um, then uh, go out to TalesFromTheHicks.com. We got the store out there. We got <laughs> a couple. garage. <laughs> we got the Boner Garage shirts. Shirt. Uh, that hasn't even come out yet, though, has it, that episode? Uh, today. Uh, tomorrow? In tomorrow, about a half an hour. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 
Um, yeah, so we got the Boner Garage, uh, the men's and women's, or men's and men's, whatever. Uh, Jelly or Jam shirt, uh, good, how are you? Um, dick hard, hard Dick and Cider. Um, yeah, so we got a bunch of, a bunch of the new one shirts out there. Uh, hatch, hatchet? Hatcheted. Yeah, we were talking about that guy. Uh, the Hatchet guy. The Hatchet guy. Um, oh, yeah. And for those of you that did not win the backpack, we have I that out there. Svetlana. I support Svetlana. <laughs> <laughs> I have not seen these. I haven't been on here for a while. There's the Suicide Wink Contest second place <laughs> trophy. <laughs> <laughs> Which, yeah. That means you got caught. Yeah. Um, There's a nice shirt for shit nuggets. for Christmas. <laughs> uh-huh. um, yeah, drawstring back. Oh, uh, oh. So at the zoo, when we were at the zoo, walking through the zoo, mom, because she had won the drawstring back, oh, yeah. she had that, and she had some waters in there, and she had a couple of little, little things in there. Hydration. Pump. Yeah. Damn. <coughs> Towel. Oh, that, milk pump. Sure yeah. yeah. It's all good. I'm surprised she doesn't have the milk truck, milk truck. <laughs> <laughs> uh, get this for Lacey for, you should have gotten that for her. For Let's see if you can make it, get a shirt. Uh, that we can put on there just for your mom. It's got like a couple Velcro patches. <laughs> just unvelcro and release, release the Kraken, so to speak, so it's easy access for you. Uh huh. Yes. It'll be your Sunday wear. Yep. Um, oh, and then also, since it is getting to be uh, cooler out, we have the hoodies. So. Yes. Check them out. Yeah. Go out there. Uh, talesfromthehicks.com send us an email hicks at talesfromthehicks.com like and subscribe tell your friends smash that like button share with people you know especially the ones you don't yes that's right and then join us next week again send us your scary stories scary stories I want to hear them I'll wear earplugs so I don't have to listen to them just don't wear your headphones scary take your headphones off you won't hear us it still seems scary Hmm. yeah all we'll right then. We All right. Yeah. Until next time. Later. Sounds Have a good, good. week. All right. Adios.